hasa wenye watachukua hizi hawatambua ha ndio kwanza hiyo video ikifali in case mpaka tunawatolea We are marking our timbers green because thieves have become a problem here. Hata ngombe watu wanapaka anga marangi. Eh kinapaka warangi. Ama kinawekwa notch. So this is a mark to identify our staff. So if someone steals and we find them, we'll see they have a green mark. These have become a problem here with our timbers here. Because they came last night and they took our timbers here, man. We had a lot of timber this side. First they dropped them off. You guys have seen in my videos timbers here standing vertical. Now they stole some but we took some in the store. So we decided to not leave anything here. Because they are using our wire. We still put wire but they are climbing up. Me I feel like we need to put a wall here. A very high rise wall but first Let's go step by step. We first put our timbers marks. Now once we mark, nothing will be will defeat us in identifying our stuff. We'll mark even these ones here, this side. My friends, we've marked everything here, even on the behind part. So now, if a thief will try to steal here, it'll be hard back door. So now we are marking even the ones on top. But for this side, We've cleared everything. So no leaves here. No entertainment for leaves. Kachonjo. Now we want to mark this. I'll take a camera to take a mark to it. Iki kibao kiri kwa kina kai ki, ata rangi yenye iri kwa ina kina kai rangi. Ana tumbo ya kwa 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 tumbo ya
yani wanakuja wanangoa hii ah oh, wanatoa hii wana hii Guys, I'm here in my store. We brought all the scaffolds that were on the fence side in the store. And also, we got a very big torchlight. This will give a security man. If we ever get a security man. Because now these have become a big problem here. So this torch will help in catching a thief at night. I am planning for security man things here. I have very many timbers here. So it's charging. It's charging for over 12 hours here. Good afternoon guys from Africa, Kenya. The storm is coming on the east, so here in two hours time it's gonna be raining pretty pretty much. So our timbers here, like I did show you guys in the morning, we marked them with paint. You see? We, we marked them with paint green, so if someone steals, we will actually know. So if we decide to trace all our timbers, we can know. We had painted our timbers in green stuff. We closed this window and actually it was very very helpful. So here the only challenge I'm now having is thieves. Since we started construction here there has never been a single case of theft. But what is now attracting thieves here is timber my friend. So me, my wish and my heart desire is to put blocks all around the house on top because these timbers they are visible from very 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 far actually from down there someone can see them from that other side someone can see them someone who is uh, using uh, the valley the hill right there that other side coming down the hill using the tarmac you can actually see the house it's visible from so far so i think that's what is attracting people here and also i'm gonna do a makeover of this small gate because i realized it's uh, hitting someone's head this gate if you are tall you have to like bend to go through in you know now here everybody walking around is a suspect because here timber is being stolen and now we are asking ourselves who who is this stealing timber here in villa found but above all i want to thank i am marwa for great great inspiration through this uh, platform because through this platform we was able to do all this our water is still intact there is actually water so if you want water here you can shower and bathe and drink water you'll never go thirsty at villa found my friend let me show you here there is water plenty plenty you see So here there is water and we put this small mouth in here to cover the tap so nobody will know that there is a tap. Yeah. So my friends, if you are watching this from USA, just know me I am not feeling happy here or anywhere in the world because thieves, they are giving us headaches. You know, you guys saw me going to the forest to get the timber. Very early in the morning until I got lost, I didn't know where the forest was. So what is existing is, you see these lengthy, these lengthy timbers here, we finished them. 
So if a thief steals one of these, my friends, we are going reverse. You'll not see roofing here, my friend. And that is what is giving me headaches here, man. These ones we already finished because my mason asked for a certain number of these lengthy timbers and we used them and they were enough. So if someone steals this, we are going back to zero, like scratch again. Now we'll not proceed with roofing. We have to make another one like this. You see? Now we removed the scaffolds behind here because we fear they will come for them now me what i want to prevent is hey these ones which are on top here man imagine someone just coming out of nowhere their work is just to pick pick me i don't blame myself yes we don't have like a good fence but me i think these timbers are creating a lot of attention it's just if we had blocks here we'd have already put them even today 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 if we had blocks these timbers they are visible from so far my friends especially if someone is coming from down there on the road coming down from the hill also that other field they are visible and some it's like they've just been kept like it's like drying corn in the sun so it's like announcing, hey, here we are, we are corn, come and get us. See the storm, how it's coming. But meanwhile, me, I think I am Marwa. A lot, a lot, a lot, because he inspired us to start this, even if thieves are giving us headaches. You see, no scaffold here. So the ones that remained is the ones next to this wall, because now if they try touching this, they will be hard. Because you have to like touch these iron sheets and they will wake up and the ones in the front is also hard so the only ones we removed is for this side because they are taking advantage of this side me my prayer is that they don't touch the ones which are on the rooftop and if we catch one thief me i'm telling you a thief maybe the thief is watching this vlog if you are the thief stealing timber here, I will not say anything. Let me just keep quiet. But guys, if we catch a thief here, I'm telling you there will be a very big funeral for the thief. Because me, I work so hard every day here, then someone just come and fix our timber. Me, I hope I will not catch a thief here. But I'm saying if we catch the thief, ah, the following day will be a funeral for that thief. Because it really pains me <laughs> working so hard. You better steal blocks, my friend, if you are the thief. Come pick these blocks, ah, but not the timber. Because taking timbers here is taking us reverse. I am so bitter with thieves. Now we marked everything. So if we decide to trace, we just follow these marks. Even the ones on the rooftop, we marked them. Let me go up, I show you my friend. You see everything, everything here. So if we decide to trace stolen timber and we find just one with a green mark. My friend, it's so painful being stolen something but me i'm just calm until we catch a thief me i will not forgive a thief you do everything else you come sleep here but not steal you see we marked everything all timbers here we we've marked with green so if we catch a thief me, I'm telling you, ha, forgiving will not be in my hands. Because these things, hey, the way we got them and struggled to get, I don't think I will allow anyone to come here and just touch anything how they feel like.
I'm also told they went, the thieves went to that church. <laughs> and they stole microphones in the church. <laughs> now me here. I have to put someone who will be looking after this until we put a roof here and until we'll put a wall but let's do away with the thief but when we catch a thief when we catch a thief I already said what will happen because that we will not forgive you you have given us headaches you thief and we are tired of you ha, so much You've never seen me in pain. Pain of being stolen. No, 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 no. You guys wait. So now, here next step is roofing. And we want to roof everything. This timber, someone coming with a vehicle from the hill, right there down, can see this timber. And someone can plan anything. You see, timbers are really, really hot cake. Really hot cake. Timbers are hot cake. So, they are as much as gold. Because timber is actually more expensive than metal here in our country. If I am wrong, you rectify me. But what I know is, timber is very, very expensive more than metal. So, this being here like this on display... This is calling for very, very, very urgent, urgent, urgent attention. That we put blocks around the house and we put iron sheets. Now me here, I will be left crying, crying. I like how... Oh, here you have to be careful. Walking on top. I like the small design my masons did put for this small <laughs> for these small timbers here this is the small washroom so now we will rise blocks round the house round 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 so that we don't give these a chance the only thing they will not take here is iron sheets because that one even before you took you take away one you've already been hard so my friends, this is the new look of Villa Found. Just that leaves are trying to give us headaches. We'll put a perimeter wall, guys. You don't worry, don't stress, okay? But me, it has really pained me because this is day two. So we are planning something and that plan is to catch a thief. And if we catch a thief, that will be... Either your last day or a day you will never forget. Because it re it's really painful someone coming to where touching this is like touching my heart with a knife. And me, I will not allow someone to do that here. So my friends, here roofing, we are preparing to roof. You see, we marked everything. We marked everything here. Nothing, nothing, nothing was left like that. So if they remove one and we trace, if it has this mark, you will never forget that day. The storm is coming. Our timbers are already dry. In as much as they want to be stolen, rain is also posing another challenge. I don't want these timbers to get rained on. Guys, me, I am not crying, crying. It's just that thieves are trying to make us feel inferior. Because they are coming for these timbers, it's like it belongs to them. <laughs> Ooh. Actually, I should not be walking on top like this because now it's like I'm showing them, oh, you can walk up and pick the timber you want 
but a very very warning has been put that if you are found here or caught here you will see a very rough day so my friends we are still pushing with this house uh, everything is okay the rains and these are posing a great challenge for the roofing parts every stage of construction has its own challenge every part of construction has its own challenge also we will put window grills and a front door metallic door so nobody can you know the moment these enter this house they've already seen how things look inside so in future they already have a map of that house in their head maybe they'll know oh here we will have tv here we'll have a bed so it's better to prevent this things right now so my friends it's raining and i'm telling you here we will catch a thief and that day i will film for you that thief so you see who is preventing us from achieving our goal oh yanni yanni is hunting for a thief and soon we'll catch a thief you just wait very very soon we will catch a thief here theft at villa found imagine guys since we started nobody has ever stolen anything here now that we are in the roof part someone is wanting to steal oh, oh. me I, i'm waiting just to catch that thief. Now imagine guys the loss we have gone here is so big because say tomorrow we want to place blocks imagine my masons have to spend half a day putting scaffolds then they do half work of the blocks you know this is taking us rivers and as we want to go forward not rivers it's windy because the storm is coming you see they even scratched the floor they scratched the floor look they scratched the floor as they were stealing timber what i know is we will catch a thief we'll put also window grills here guys you don't worry okay we'll put window grills even this will take will build it like two courses will build will build two courses here of blocks so it becomes one two three four five and we'll put grills here we'll put a very big door here and a window grill and a grill but for now we put everything up so you guys don't worry okay roofing is a stage that is coming along with its own uh, staffs and me I am ready for anything Kopoasana I already showed you pictures of everything. Let me check guys so I show you more pictures of what I want. For this villa found. So on the walls on the walls of the house you see like say right there we'll put a TV wall and here will be our sitting. So we'll put this kind of light guys. this kind of light will put it next let me show you these lights i don't know why maybe my screen is dark we want this circular chandelier for the living room chandelier for living room we want this one 
let me show you one more guys so you can see what i want for villa found what i want for villa found something something very very cool you see these lights looking like a ring these ones we want starting from here from the door of the toilet all the way from the door of the toilet going like that like that all the way to that end in the master bedroom we will put these kind of lights on the ceiling circular circular light something very beautiful but first we want to prevent this that thing has pained me because i'm repeating it a lot so we have a few blocks that has remained here these are two less but some will be used to fix uh, gaps when we are finishing the two courses of blocks around the house so we will finish that me first now guys uh, i want to say thank you to ayam marwa for inspiring finding ian here because we have really put a lot of effort since day one you guys have been watching me since day one building this since we started digging the foundation we put the foundation it's right here now we are standing on it since we put these walls day by day since we put these metals these uh, hook iron you know until you guys saw us putting the lean top ah, but this was the most hard stage of my life this one this lentil this one guys ah uh, this lentil was the hardest part this one this ah uh, this was the hardest part lento my friends lento putting timbers alone one week ah uh, the following week took putting timber and again putting the lento like making the concrete this one guys if you are building a house or if you've built a house i don't know what is your experience is but for me the lento was the hardest part of construction my gopro says 24 percent i want to film for like 40 minutes you see this lento but this will put plaster guys you'll not see anything here we'll put plaster right now i'm in the master bedroom and it looks like this but first guys i want us to put blocks around the house so that our timbers cannot be stolen and we put iron sheets even this ladder we have marked it because they might come get in the house and then start kicking this timbers out but we will make it very hard for someone to come and steal here but when we will put a wall you know even without the perimeter wall say you put gypsum and you don't even have a door and window grills someone will come in then take all the gypsum away so a home a home a home comes along with other extra costs along the way and it's upon you to know how to mitigate such things in the process you see so now imagine guys adif adif came to villa found got in the bedroom right there and removed the supporting beam of the scaffold here I can't even want to imagine a thief came in this bedroom. You know if someone else now is coming into your space, it makes it feels uncomfortable. I love how strong how strong this beam was. My friends, me I really thank I am Marwa for the inspiration. It's been a whole 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 lot of progress since day 1 up to now. We are still pushing and we are not giving up here we don't quit we just move 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 you know? so that is it my friends so here work will resume very very soon as soon as we get blocks and a few cement 
Ha, me, I think we will even use this sand. The pre where we will reach with this sand is where... I think this will be enough for 200 blocks. We'll mix it purely. We'll measure if it gets 10, 10 cement, 10 wheelbarrows of sand if we get them from here. 10 wheelbarrows of sand, we get them from here. And five bags of cement. We put blocks. Then we put iron sheets. Then thieves will have a very hard time with these timbers here. Yesterday we sprayed our compound. Today is weekend, guys. You know, sometimes posting on weekends, people are resting off social media. You know. We did spray these green stuffs. You can see they are now turning yellow you can see they are turning yellow we want everything here we are, we are suppressing the seeds because the seeds were underground so we are suppressing them we also got a very very big padlock for our store this was the first thing we built i know thieves might have attempted to put their hand inside and maybe see if there's tight padlock but here we are planning to put floodlights we will we will erect a tall metallic beam or a, a tall metallic stand and we will put uh, an automatic floodlight that if someone passes it gets to light the compound you see this road here it somehow extends to this remaining V here so now our scaffolds are out my friends Villa found progress is like that wow so this this stretch I don't know what its name is, but we want to put these on this side. We want to put it on this side. That's my neighbor's dog, and when thieves are coming here, it barks. They say they hear the dog barking so loud. So we want to put that stretch on this other side. You know, if this land was ours, if the land behind this fence was ours, we'd have fenced up to my neighbor's stick wall. But now, this is a path. Everyone is passing here behind us. So now making it so vulnerable. But my friends, we keep pushing day in day out. This thing is so rigid and it's very, very important. We locked our gate so nobody can come in. Oh, whoa, Villa found. Stay strong, Villa found. A stranger is asking for work for plaster. I don't even know if he's a qualified <laughs> plaster guy or a mason. Here you just don't let anyone in. What? Guys, the only challenge we are having here is theft. I think it's because of the timber but we are trying to mitigate that problem and we intercept the problem uh, you see from the road there are very many people are looking at this place so the timbers are creating too much attention 
and maybe discussion in the village you know not everyone has something like this so people just think of destroying 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 but me i thank marwa for inspiring us to do this I know I've repeated the, 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 the thieves part a lot of times in this short vlog. It's because it has really pained me. Someone just coming and picking something we've worked hard for. But I don't blame myself because I as Finding Ian has not put a perimeter wall. Because if you put a perimeter wall it will be very hard for someone to come in. But with such a fence someone just crosses in and picks what they want. So I still don't blame myself. So that is it my friends. So here we will push. Um, so we are waiting guys to see if we'll get blocks, couple cement and iron sheets. At least we finish. You know once we do the roofing, the only thing which is making theft here to become is the timbers guys. Nothing else. Timber is more expensive than metal. And these will do their best to pick. So. I'll not feel I'll not feel vulnerable at the same time because it's not my fault. It's just that the fact we don't have the blocks to hide the timber and the iron sheets. But we will put that with time. You guys don't worry, okay? Here you can even sit, put a chair. I loved how thick we did put it. Wow, man. Window grills. Lento, I hope you guys saw if you're wanting to build and you're in Kenya and you maybe you are getting inspired by Ian here. See how thick the lintel is. See how thick we put our lintel. So thick. Thicker even than the <laughs> thicker than the bricks. You know. And we'll also buy grass. Guys, I'm thinking of buying grass and we we plant grass. In our compound the, the spongy grass we will plant the spongy grass so when a house is going to such a level especially in the villages you don't need to have everyone throwing their eyes so we'll put a wall guys we'll put a wall you trust me we'll put a very smart wall here so when you are inside you have your privacy because you can't even furnish the house when it's like this, when it's open like this. You need so much privacy. So guys, that is it. So let me see if I'll make it going to town. And I will see you around, okay? Hit that like button. Guys, I'm in town. Good afternoon. Oh, whoa. So, we'll buy floodlights and CCTV for Villa Found. Not here in town, we'll order online. A home comes along with very many issues along the way you never even planned for now things like security concern and much much many more stuff so welcome to the channel welcome to my hometown uh, we are pushing Today is uh, Saturday, it's weekend here, and this place being a tourist place, you'll find very many people with vehicles doing their weekend stuff in this town. So my friends, 
come along with me as we explore and as as we keep building and pushing villa found slowly slowly actually with plaster for villa found i will want it done in two days plaster two days so we will get masons oh i love this white car looks cute i don't know if it's sapphire or serena oh it's serena small vitz mazda on sundays this town is completely deserted but on Saturdays, very many people. That guy let me pass. So now I can move on with my journey the calmness of this town gives you like a free free movement you don't have to be scared who will snatch your bag I don't know what see like these ones moving with ease and I really do miss eating fruits I don't know when last I ate sugar car. Let me cross the road. If Villa Found land was a very big piece of land, we'd have planted this type of tree. But since we have limited space, we have to look for trees that don't occupy too much space. Like the ones we saw in Ayamarwa village. <coughs> so let me cut across through this small park here. It looks so silent and the trees are so tall. One thing I know about these trees is that they are very, very old. From since I was a kid up to now, <laughs> they are still here. You can't even cut these trees here because they will be arrested for sure. Oh, my GoPro front screen is on. I, I usually love it when it's off. And my GoPro says 5%. My hometown. Business booms on Saturdays. That's a sweater for ladies for cold. Hey, 
Tangazo, 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 tangazo. Tupo hapa kwa ajili yako Nani, 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 nani.